Okay, how long would you last in this scenario? Your fridge is on the fritz and the manufacturer sent a technician eight times, but it's still not working. The Fox 5 I team's Dana Fowl says that's when you turn to call for action. Dana. Eight times. Wow. And a part was replaced. Get this five times still wasn't working fed up a Fox 5 viewer reached out to call for action our all volunteer group that gets results we've had 11 repairmen 11 repairmen for a refrigerator a new one still under warranty first started running water all over my floor Fox 5 viewer Ellen Harville had a new fridge okay. acting like an old one on the fritz Water was not coming out of the old fridge. The ice maker, she says, was frozen, freezing up much of the unit. Seriously, listen to this. We had six new ice makers put on it, two water valves, two water lines, a whole new freezer door. They sent a freezer door and it was dented and damaged. This all went on in the first year of owning this refrigerator. I sent certified letters and told them I wanted my money back or a new refrigerator. Nothing just more repairmen. Then the warranty ran out. No working fridge. Her mother-in-law brought over an old one. We brought the old one up here and the ice maker on it worked fine and it's 40 years old. <laughs> but she also turned to call for action. And I called call for action and it didn't take long then at all. It was no time. The all-volunteer group based here at Fox 5 News got Sandra Washington on the job. Every time she was dealing with the manufacturer, they were trying to come up with another way to fix it or to fix at the problem without ever solving it. Call for action went to the top. Soon enough, Ms. Harville got a call from the manufacturer. They had never been all that nice <laughs> before, but they were real nice this time. And here's the result. Not a new part, not a rebuilt fridge, but a new refrigerator, a brand new one. Call Fox 5, call for action because they'll get it done. <laughs> and she's right about that. But listen, we have done so many stories lately on appliances that seem to be breaking down with less than stellar customer service. Before you buy, find out from the retailer who you can reach out to in the event of a repair, them or the manufacturer. Do an exhaustive search of that manufacturer's response history. Look at the company's webpage to see if you're satisfied with what's on there. I'm leaving you breadcrumbs, people. So Yeah, right? <laughs> I love that rave review from her, though. I mean, she's telling you exactly oh, yeah. what you need to do. You need yeah. to call, call for action after yeah. you do your homework. Yeah. yeah, and that's absolutely what you do. And go to our website fox5atlanta.com. Go to the iTeam section and there you'll find all the information you need to connect to call for action yourself. And you know they still have appliance stores? Mm -hmm. Not just the big boxes where you get them. Honest to Pete, I just found this out. <laughs> Everybody yeah. in my office says, well, I just go to a small appliance store. Huh. I didn't even know they still existed, yeah, but they here. do. And that and you get real one-on-one -on -one service there. Cool. Love seeing these success so stories, Dana. Mm -hmm. Very cool. All right.